So Stormcast 6 a.m. Most of these showers are continuing to push off towards the east. Here are those lingering low clouds, but these continue to push east as the morning progresses. They may be stubborn for some of our far eastern counties, but to the west, you see plenty of sunshine. That's what everybody is going to see for the afternoon hours. In fact, I think by mid to late afternoon, we're dealing with wall to wall sunshine. So no matter how much cloud cover you have to start with, you're going to see a lot of sunshine by the end of the day. 42 degrees right now in Lincoln Airport, 40 in Beatrice, 39 in York, 40 in Hastings, 39 degrees in Kearney. Most of us sitting in the upper 30s and lower 40s at this time. Look at the wind speeds. They're breezy out of the northwest 15 miles per hour sustained with even higher gusts in Lincoln uh, 22 miles per hour in Grand Island and Hastings. And again, these are the sustained wind speeds, not the gusts as you have throughout the day today. I think anywhere from 15 to 25 miles per hour for wind speeds out of the northwest, but at least we're going to be warm 43 degrees by 9 o'clock 49 by 11 into the 50s this afternoon, topping out near 56 degrees in the capital city, maybe nearing the 60 degree mark as you get closer to the Nebraska Kansas state line. I think most of us will be in the 50s today. Good chance of reaching 50 degrees tomorrow as well. Partly cloudy on Tuesday to our north. There might be a couple of isolated rain or snow showers, but I think we have enough dry air to work with in southern Nebraska, where I think the forecast stays dry along in south of I-80. March 1st on Wednesday, partly cloudy skies, a high near 50 degrees. Now the hiccup in terms of temperatures, that comes on Thursday. We'll scale back on high temperatures. There is a chance to see a couple of snow showers as well. Most of that moisture should fall just to the south, but something we're watching. 46 though on Friday, warming right back up. And then for Saturday and Sunday, 50s return. It should be a pretty nice weekend overall.